It's time for another 172 second review. This time, Logistico by Corne Van Morsel, published by Kowali. Logistico is a pick up and deliver game for two to five players in which players earn money for delivering colored cubes to discs of the same color. In order to do this, players have use of a boat, an airplane, and a truck. The boat can hold four cubes and moves around in the water areas. The plane can hold three cubes and flies from airport to airport, and the truck holds just two cubes and drives on the road. The starting points for these vehicles are randomly determined at the start of the game, as is the distribution of the cubes and discs. Players also get three secret location cards, promising a bonus if they're able to deliver there. In each round of the game, players will trigger, in order, their boats, then their planes, then their trucks. The more actions a vehicle takes, the more it will cost the player. Players start with 40 logi, the currency in the game, and also the player's victory points, but it's easy to burn through that initial cash if you're not careful. Players spend actions to load cubes onto a vehicle, drop off or deliver cubes, and move from area to area. Boats move between adjacent sea zones. Airplanes spend one action to move from one airport to any other, and trucks spend one action to move on the road and two to go off-road. Only one boat at a time can occupy a space, as well as only one truck on the land. Planes can share airport spaces freely. Transferring cubes between your vehicles is free, and coordinating the movements of your vehicles is imperative if you want to make longer-range deliveries. When players successfully deliver to a matching disc, the cube and disc are removed, and they get paid based on this chart. The first column is for a simple delivery, the second is for a delivery to one of your bonus locations, and the third is for visiting your bonus location if somebody else delivers there first. These payouts will increase each round, so deliveries later in the game will be more lucrative but harder to achieve. Each round, players must perform at least one action with their boat and truck, while the plane can stay put if desired. At the end of each round, players must pay three logi for each cube still on their vehicles. The payout indicator slides down one space and a new round begins. Near the end of the game, rather than taking an action with your boat or truck, you can sell it for three logi. Be careful though, once sold, you can't get it back. Once there are six or fewer discs left on the board at the end of a round, players get one more turn with each of the vehicles. Once complete, most money wins. Logistico is a dry, distilled version of pick up and deliver, but I feel that's part of its charm. At the start of the game, players focus on those quick, easy deliveries, trying to snatch them before their opponents, but they must quickly shift to the longer term plans that will get cubes to their bonus locations or preserve opportunities to deliver in the later portion of the game. If you're a pick up and deliver fan, Logistico is well worth a look. Nine out of 10. I'm Eric Summerer, and that's another 172 second review. For more video reviews and my favorite audio podcast, please visit Dicetower.com. Thanks for listening. The Dice Tower is sponsored by Cool Stuff Inc. Cool stuff in stock at CoolStuffInc.com.